Welcome back everyone to episode number 11 of our season number 3 of Minecraft and in today's episode it's going to be a super action packed video. I'm going to briefly showcase what I did off camera. As you can see, today we're going to begin construction on the Skylight 2.0. So this is going to allow a bunch of natural sunlight into my underground base here and this is what I'm going to be working on in today's episode. So as you can see, on this side I have this this kind of um, polished diorite going all the way down and this is going to differentiate and separate each of my underground farms and various rooms. So yeah guys, that's what we're going to work on today. I'm going to briefly showcase the top portion of my base because I added four of those shroom lights into this main fortress hub room, which is really nice. I, I think this really, it adds to the depth of the floor and then I'll be able to have my uh, nice bed set up or something over here. So, yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you think. And once once we uh, start working on this actual structure, the episodes are going to flow a lot better. Ooh, what the hell is that? Okay, I have no idea who those guys are, but they have... Looks like they have some crossbows or something. Yeah, I don't know. That's kind of creepy. <laughs> But um, I'm going to flatten out this whole entire mountain. This is what I did off camera, was I kind of cleared this all out because this is going to be the top portion of my base, this whole entire mountain top up here. So it's going to connect with this. There's going to be a second story. And I'm thinking about doing like a little, um, like a tree farm that's going to be encased in a glass like cube. And it'll look really cool. It'll be like a natural biome that'll be protected under a glass case. So... You, you guys will see what I'm going to work on in the future. But that's what we're going to do in today's episode, guys. So I think we're going to start off, actually, with getting a bunch of glass and doing that first. Because, as you can see over here, I have a ton of glass that I s sort of prepared off-camera. And I, hopefully I don't run into those enemies that are over there. Those guys are kind of creepy. <laughs> but I am recording today, Sunday the... Yeah, Sunday the 20th of February. Hopefully everyone had a good week with Valentine's Day. Um, I know just this year is just flying by. All of these years really are going super fast. But this will be a nice probably 15 to 20 minute episode for today. Building this Skylight version 2.0. And I think this is going to be a nice aesthetic look. It's going to add some a little bit of depth to my building design. So, this is probably going to be my most action-packed season of Minecraft. I really jumped the gun on Season 2 years ago, and I never finished that walkthrough series. It's one of my... I'm kind of disappointed in myself. It's, it was a disappointing moment. But who cares? That's alright. That was years ago anyways. Because a lot of people were really getting into my Minecraft Season 2 when I was building the mansion and my outpost on the top of the mountain. But uh, that's just another project that was never completed. <laughs> but I will be taking some inspiration from my previous seasons, as well as Season 1. Because Season 1 was really an amazing build, that Russian city project. I highly recommend you go check out that season on my channel. One of my more popular videos of all time. There we go, I'm glad I made all this glass. Hopefully we have enough to just finish what we need to here. Which, oh no, we're, we're probably going to need a lot more. That's okay, I'll finish that off camera too. Whenever I do these building videos, I'm going to try to prepare the area and gather as many resources as I can prior to the episode, so that way it'll be nice and quick. You guys don't have to see me clearing out blocks and stuff, because that's boring. Alright guys, let's do, ooh, damn it, I didn't want to do that. See, too bad I didn't have a silk touch. I'm trying not to destroy these glass blocks because they're very, they're really valuable in my opinion, especially for this design. Okay, we got one more stack left. I hope this is gonna last. If not, we're gonna have to make a run to that desert biome, that beach that we found in the previous episode. By the way, in my previous video, when we were working on the nether, I'm going to have to showcase that at the end of this episode, because I really spruced it up off camera. You guys will be pretty impressed with it, too. 
and I was a really big fan of that crimson wood so I will be using that texture for a majority of my builds coming up look at this guys we're almost done I think at least we won't have to worry about this now okay just a little bit a little more longer but that's good we finished a lot oh my gosh look at this this is incredible and yeah so I guess now we could start filling in this side and then we'll fill in this side and then we'll go and meet back on the top of uh, the skylight 2.0 uh, yeah let's see I'm gonna need some wood we'll grab you know what I can't remember if this is a half slab or not I guess the half slabs will work just fine Plus, it, it can extend our materials. Okay, let's do this. Let's go in here. We'll just make some half slabs instead. Plus, we don't have to worry about using everything. Okay, we'll go here. And this is good. Alright, a dark oak. So my design is going to pretty much go like this. We're going to have this this polished diorite, the the dark oak, and then the birch, so it'll really really bright, brighten it up. Um, oh, also I know what we need. So we need to grab some birch half slabs. So we'll take these, and then I'll probably need to make a bunch more of these. Hopefully I gathered enough off camera. There we go. Perfect, guys. Look at that. Nice. So far, so good. We're going to get rid of the shovel. Uh, this shovel, too. Whoops. And we'll also get rid of this flint. Because I want to have easy access to all of my materials for this episode. Yeah, so I guess we'll just keep going down here. Just like this. So really easy. I'm so glad I did this off camera. I don't want you guys to get bored and you know what I mean. Have to just keep watching me do the same material gathering and stuff like that. My weekly checklist, as I like to call it. Dang it. Alright, hopefully there's no enemies around. I don't know. In the beginning of this video I saw like a bunch of they look like villagers that were zombies or something. Maybe those are the pillagers that they're talking about, I don't know. My friend Gerardo was mentioning in the comments down below. Yeah, he's just, he's been a great help throughout all of these episodes. Giving some great feedback. There we go. Okay, so that side is done. Now, we could just do this. Aw, oh, crap, you know what? I probably shouldn't have. I probably shouldn't have done the half slabs because it's going to be a, a bigger pain. Especially like this. I'm going to have to keep placing them all individually here. Okay, yeah, we'll do that next. I I'm not going to worry about that right now. Let's, You know what? Let's just do this side first. That way it'll be a lot quicker. I wish I would have did that before. <laughs> oh well, guys, it's all a learning experience. Whoops. Oh, my block placing skills is kind of crappy today. I've been getting a lot of great response on my previous episodes that I've uploaded. So thank you guys so much for all the support. I really appreciate it. By the way, recently I, I traveled to a location in Pittsburgh, which is called Phipps Conservatory and Botanical Gardens. And I highly recommend if you guys are into nature or taking photos or videos of like different types of plants I know it was just absolutely insane there so yeah that video is under my Pittsburgh travel series the Berg episode number three by the way this year I will be doing some more Pittsburgh themed episodes so that's always something to look forward to all right that's good and I think we could continue over here. Yeah, I'm gonna just I'm gonna just finish this side too. We might as well. 
even though it's going to take a little bit more time, we got to get it done. Looks like it's already turning nighttime. Jeez. All right, we're going to do our same method. And I don't know if I'll finish the top portion of the skylight because that's going to be one large room that's going to be up top on the mountain. And eventually I'm going to have a minecart system in there connecting to the various locations throughout my world. So it's really going to be amazing when it's all said and done. Maybe I can incorporate some lanterns or shroom lights in the, into this tunnel. The possibilities are really endless. So let's go sleep real quick. And one of the reasons why I wanted to make this a shorter episode is because my last video took forever to upload. It was over like 12 gigabytes. So that's one thing I need to improve upon is keeping a consistent time for each episode. Because I don't want to be up till like 1.30 in the morning <laughs> waiting on this stuff to upload. I could always just leave my computer on, but I'm real OCD about that. I just like to get stuff done. Turn off my computer. There we go. Alright, so that's good. Now we just have to continue with this pattern. The dark oak half slabs. It's really going to be a pain, too, because I, I kind of messed this up. We just have to make sure we hit it in the corner here. And also, another thing, this week I will be posting... The, sec the first episode of my Season 2 of the n n Nostalgia Gaming Series. Oh my god, I can't speak today. So that's going to be a, a great installment. And I'm super happy to be playing some retro games again. Alright, so now we're at the good spot. We can just continue all the way down. Yeah, one of the reasons why I wanted to use these materials is because I have a pretty much an abundance of them. There we go. Look at this, guys. The skylight is nearly complete. It's looking great, too. Alright, and you know what I'm going to do now is I'm probably going to work on the top portion. At least the start of it. I would like to Maybe clear this out here and put some more birch slabs, half slabs. That way it'll give it a nice design from above and below. Oh man, this is great. I love this. Okay, so let's go out here. And we'll go all the way around. See, that's another thing. Is that I want to make an easier access route up to this top level, which is why I'm going to have a second story with some ladders on the inside connecting everything. Uh, Alright, you know what? I wonder if we should keep... Or, you know what? Let's, let's do this. Let's see how half slabs look. It's probably going to look a little weird. I'm just kind of curious here. I think this is going to look cool. The way I want to do it here. I just want to see if it'll help with the skylight itself. Alright guys, so far so good. Now let's just go here. It does look like it's working though. You can see how much, how bright it is now. Perfect. Yeah, I think I think I like this design. Probably should have just used full blocks, but that's all right. <laughs> it's basically twice the work. All right, so now let's go back out or go down below, and just take a, a brief look. I want to see how it looks from down below. Another thing we're going to have to do is we're going to have to get rid of this. Because this is going to be uh, all cleared out eventually. 
Oh man, this is gonna be sweet, guys. Alright, so far I am really liking this design. Let's just do a little bit more on this side. That way I could get a better idea how this is gonna look when it's all said and done. But the reason why I'm using this birch too is because look, it just makes it really bright. I like the birch and the quartz. And with that dark oak as an outline on the inside, it looked great. Sweet. Super satisfied with this. We're getting a lot of things accomplished in this episode. That's good. And then in, by the time the next episode comes around, everything will be completed. Ooh, look at that. I really like that. Just nice and it's real clean looking. Yep. So that's, I'm going to go with this. The birch is going to go all the way down and then all the way down on this side too. Beautiful, guys. Alright, so I guess what we could work on now is getting this polished diorite, which I made off camera. Let's fill all of this in. Whoops, did I put that back? Yeah, I want that stuff. <clears throat> I love this. And yeah, so I'm going to continue this now. And we're gonna, we're still going to have the andesite separating each column, I guess you could say. But I just want to place all of these. So you get the whole picture. Whoops. All right, nice. So I'm glad I made a bunch of this. And then all of these are all going to be rooms under here. Pretty amazing when you think about it. The, the progress we've made so far in this season. It's only episode 11 too. And we're almost done with this fortress. Actually I wouldn't say that. we got a lot more work to go. <laughs> there we go. Just keep filling it in. Pretty simple if you ask me. That's why it's it's crucial that you have all your resources together. Okay, and it will figure out something cool here for the end. I'm probably going to just continue it all the way out till this ends here. And yeah, I like this. I really, really like this. Great choice for sure. <clears throat> and over here, I wanted to just explain something really quickly. I'm going to have like a little hollowed out section over here for brewing stands and everything. And wait, let's see. How wide is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, let's do this too while we're at it. Get my iron shovel. And then we'll also set up the next episode here. I definitely want to go spelunking, do a little bit of cave exploration. That's cool. It's probably good for now. And then we'll have uh, little stands and stuff. I'll fix that off camera. <clears throat> okay, so this next section is going to be my enchanting, enchanting room. Ugh. So you're going to walk in here and have all the bookshelves around you with the enchantment table. So that's going to be in this section. And then probably just some more underground animal farms and various rooms like that. So, I think that's going to do it for today, guys. That's pretty much all I wanted to do. Oh, wait. Before we end, we got to show you the nether really quickly. But let me know what you guys think of this design off camera. I think it's beautiful. The Skylight 2.0. I like how you could actually see out and everything. It just adds a whole depth to your base design. Okay, and now this is going to be my brief showcase of my nether... Uh, the nether hub so I am in a crimson forest which is very dangerous because there's those giant hogling creatures over there which almost kill you in one hit so I have this sandstone the smooth sandstone half slabs the what's this called deep slate and also the diorite I think it has a nice color contrast plus I have this little door leading out here I'm not going to go out there right now and I kind of made this separate pathway off camera 
because I just fenced it off here because I, there was a hogling that was trying to get in, so... But I just did a little bit of exploration and, and gathered some shroom lights and various things in the nether. But we'll save that for another day. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching today's episode, episode number 11 of Minecraft Season 3. And stay tuned for more amazing videos coming throughout the week. Have a great day, everyone.